What's up guys, welcome back to the channel, welcome back the day after we won our first trophy in three seasons and it, it, it feels even better, it, it does feel even better, even though some might say it's it's only the Coppa Italia, um, you need to start some somewhere uh, at this stage, we've been at our lowest in the last, since the last, I don't know, 12, 13 years and you still end the season with one cup, you know, the main goal financially for the club was obviously Champions League football, football even though Winning a trophy is always big time because that goes in in the history books. Uh, getting Champions League not, but we know the situation. But it was it was a good win. It was a fantastic win. Uh, I don't think a lot of people gave us a quote unquote a shot because we were not the favorites at the game during the game, basically ahead of the game. But we did it. We managed to find a way, and uh, we deserved it. We fully deserved that. No matter what Casperini had to say. Um, he said we had chances, we did, you know, so did we. Uh, they had the possession, but they did absolutely nothing, basically, for almost 90 minutes. And we needed this, again, like, <laughs> we actually needed this. We've been talking about this team for three seasons now, ever since the channel started, and it's been depressing. It, there's There was nothing really positive. This is a positive note. However, there was some controversy post-game, and... It's very sad that there was controversy. Controversy, excuse me, because I, I'm not sure if it was anything. I think everybody saw the video where Allegri was celebrating with 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 his staff or with the with the players, and he was waving off somebody, and everybody's like, "Oh, it's Juntili," because Juntili was in the area of where he was waving off something. And some might say it was Landucci and all those things. It doesn't matter who it was at this moment in time. It doesn't. You won the Coppa Italia. It it, it doesn't need to be about that. But it has been, and the media is running with it, but it doesn't. The future is set. We won the cup. Allegri is gone. Very, very likely. I think that's kind of set in stone almost. Nothing is going to change that. If Allegri was going to stay, it's not based on the Coppa Italia. It would have been based on, we believe in Allegri, and we believe in the new project with him. It's not based on, oh, he won the Coppa Italia. A one-off game. Now we're going to change our mind. So no matter what is going on behind the scenes, Juntoli doesn't like Allegri, Allegri like. Allegri doesn't like Juntoli. It shouldn't matter on the day. It shouldn't matter half hour after full time, after you win the, the Coppa Italia, after you win your, the first trophy in the club for three years, since three years. It shouldn't be about that because that's that will resolve itself in the next couple of weeks. You know, it will. But it has been about that and it, it's it's sad. I'm not going to lie. It is sad because it shouldn't. Uh, it should have been about us. It should have been about the club winning a trophy. Finally, we deserved it. We we waited for it very, very long. It's not the big trophy. It's not the trophy everybody wants, but it's something. You know, it is something. You need to appreciate winning it. You don't need to settle, like Vlaovic said, next season, we want to win it all. Obviously, that's what you said, but like that's that should be the aim. That should be the mindset playing for Juve, winning it all. Not, oh, we won the Coppa Italia. It's been a good season. It's not been a good season. It's been a very poor season. You finish it off with a cup. That is good, but that should be the focus. We won the cup, you know. Players played well, far well for Allegri. For me, it still is a legend of the club. What he has won, nobody can dispute. Uh, it's it's a lot. Like, it's a lot. He's one of our most successful coaches in the club's history. You know, he's the coach with the most Coppa Italia, win in, Coppa Italia wins in history. Before Allegri came in, after Conte, we, had, we hadn't won a Coppa Italia for 20 years. And he won five. You know, so you need to appreciate that no matter what happened. And that should, that 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 was basically the, the point. You know, after the game, there shouldn't be any controversy. But that happened <clears throat> and the media run, ran with it. That should have just brushed aside. We know the situation at the club. We know behind the scenes. And that will be resolved at, uh, in the next couple of weeks. You know, whatever will happen. Whatever will happen. But tonight or yesterday and today, it should be about winning. You should be enjoying that. You know, you should be enjoying this. You should celebrate this. You should be extremely happy because we've been on this channel again, so depressed, you know, and talking about he's not good enough and th that's not good enough and that's bad and this is bad. There was no light at the end of the tunnel. And now it's quote unquote shining for like a day or two until reality kicks in again and, and, and tells us, okay, we need to improve big time all over the place, you know, on and off the pitch. But today... And yesterday should have been about, we won it. We did it. Like, we actually did it. It sounds insane because <clears throat> 20 years from now, 
if you have your kids, we beat Atalanta. At that point, they will probably be like, yeah, like Atalanta are poor. You should have beaten them. But that was not the case. We know how both teams went into the game. We were on a relegation form. They were on quote unquote Scudetto form. Like they were on at a good pace. They played extremely well. You know, if you watch them on the, uh, during the weekend against Roma, we all did. Everybody was like, oh my. You watch us play against Salitana, you watch him play against Cagliari, uh, against Roma, and you're like, it's going to be a long night. It wasn't a long night. It wasn't in, oh, we dominated, we created a, t- a shitload of chances. It wasn't that type of game, but we were in control. We did what we had to do to win a final, and that's it. We deserve to win it at the end. Atalanta or no Atalanta, it is what it is this moment in time. We did what we had to do. And you need to celebrate that. You need to be happy with that. You need to embrace that. You need to enjoy that, which I'm going to do for the next two or so days. And then it's back to reality, you know. Then it's about, okay, how are we going to prove, improve, excuse me, as a club. But I like to deserve this trophy uh, at the end, no matter what I think of, of him. He got us to the final. He won us the final. So you deserve to win it. You deserve to go off with something. Um, not everything is perfect, whatever. Not all the players are perfect in the team. We know that. But we did it. You know, you won the cup, enjoy it, you know, and the media is going to run with it. And it, it was a bit sad, you know, it, it didn't need to happen, uh, but it did happen. And it is what it is, I guess. That's how everything works. Um, maybe we ourselves on this channel, you know, fans do this, but we won the cup, you know, it, it's just what it is. Enjoy it and enjoy the day because we deserve this. Like we absolutely deserve this. I want to come on every single week talking about these things because knowing we will end up winning things or we will be actually in the mix until the end to for win things. That's, that's the goal, to actually be up there again, you know, and the Coppa Italia is not enough long-term, you know. This season, it is what it is. But long-term, next season, no matter who the coach is, this is still Juve. You need to win. There needs to be improvement. There needs to be something clear we can build on that can be sustainable for long-term success. Because you cannot win a Coppa Italia Two years, nothing. Another cop, like that, cannot be the case. It needs to be something, something sustainable. But that's for the next couple of weeks. Today, won the Coppa Italia, um, and yeah, enjoyed. Like again, day after, even better, even better feeling. Uh, like imagine coming on and talking about, oh, we lost again. That will, be, that will be, oh my god, that will be the absolutely last straw. You know, that would be like, okay, I'm done for the, for the channel for a couple of weeks. I will be back when the transfer window kicks off because I couldn't take it, you know, losing again in the cup final. Uh, but luckily we didn't do that. They showed up, everybody showed up uh, and they, um, they did what they had to do. They did what they had to do playing for a club like Juve and that's winning, winning the Coppa Italia. We did that, enjoy it and we will see what will happen in the next couple of days, basically. But that's it for me. Uh, I will see you guys back live tonight with some members. So uh, tune in for that. And uh, yeah, guys, have a good day. Ciao.